All right, guys, I am so excited. Check it out on a Saturday night, and we are about to go in this family video to rent a video. What the heck is this? <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm such an idiot. All right, guys, I just couldn't help it. I had to stop by here. This is a former family video. I actually filmed this one before because, as many of you know, my specialty on this channel for a long time has been the abandoned buildings, and this was an abandoned family video, but now, as you can see, it is a Subway slash Dollar General. I don't even know if the Dollar General's open. Let's just see. Maybe we can find a movie in here. I don't even know if they're open. What the? Oh, yeah, I guess so. Okay. All right, guys. Yeah, we are in what used to be the family video here, and would you look at this in the middle of a pandemic? They have toilet paper. I was really curious if there'd be anything in here that still looked anything like the family video and there's just not. It's all painted yellow and black. I'm sure they have some videos somewhere though in here so while we're in here we're gonna find it. Guys surprisingly they don't have any DVDs in there. I mean I guess if they couldn't even rent them at this location it makes sense they couldn't sell them but that kind of blows me away. Oh well, so much for the beginning of that Saturday night snack in a movie. Let's go home and see what we can make out of nothing again. So, I was trying to think of what I could make for my snack that would be deliciously tasty. I'd love to just order a pizza tonight. <laughs> that would be really deliciously tasty. But I think I'm going to make some of these Italian sausages. What I did was like a couple, well, about a month ago, whenever I went shopping to stock up, I bought a ton of meat, hamburger, and sausage, and chicken, and stuff. And I bought a bunch of these. And I portioned them out into three in a bag, and I froze them. And I set these out to thaw the other day, and I haven't used them yet, and they need to be used. So I think that's what we're going to do. We'll make those on that grill. And I have some red peppers here. I'll cut one of those up. That's still good. Yeah, I guess so. And I have some uh, onions here. Cut one of those up, too. And I think what we'll do is, like, after I make these on the griddle, the grill, whatever you want to call them here, then I'll slice them up, and I'll toss them in the pan here uh, with these chopped up, diced up, whatever. In fact, that would be good as it is, but I also have some cayenne pepper, which would be tasty, and I got some slap your mama! So maybe we'll put a little bit of that in there, too, and we can put it over top Riced cauliflower. Mm mm mm. That would be super tasty. This should be pretty good, but I don't know. I'm just kind of throwing some stuff together here and hoping for the best. All right, what movie we're going to watch? Look at this. Believe it or not, I have never seen The Page Master. 
Macaulay Culkin, so I can't imagine it's a bad movie. And it's it's like a fantasy. Look at that. I'll bet you this movie is totally awesome, but I don't think I want to watch it tonight. I'm kind of in the mood for something spooky. Wait, in fact. Wait, look, we got Friday the 13th in 3D. Look at that cover move. <laughs> but that's not what I want to watch. I still have something out from yesterday when I made a special happy birthday video for a young boy named Cooper who loves my Halloween videos. This, my friends, is a 12-foot inflatable pumpkin stack. I just happen to have two of them. So with that in mind, let's watch a Halloween movie. In fact, we're gonna watch a couple of them. Dig out my movie case from back here. But whenever Halloween rolls around every year, two movies that I watch first, right offhand. Ugh. Gigantic. But two of the very first movies I watch every year when Halloween rolls around. I watch The Legend of Sleepy Hollow by Disney, and I don't know what I did with it, so we can't watch that one tonight. However, I watch uh, It's the Great Pumpkin Charlie Brown and the original Halloween from 1978. So let's see here. Scary movie is hilarious. Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Oh, sweet. I forgot I had part two. Awesome. All right, let's see here. Where are you? Ooh, Chucky. Where are you? Tusk, Jeepers, Creepers, Freddy vs. Jason. Heck yeah. Man, this might just be a marathon night. Ah, oh, there we go. Halloween 1978, the night he came home. Yes, that's going to be one of them. And there's our other one. It's the Great Pumpkin Charlie Brown. We might even watch Monster House, too, because that is an awesome one. Yep, that's what it's going to be. A nice, fun, Halloween-themed movie night tonight. So let's go blow up those inflatables and get ready. In fact, I just happen to have a third inflatable pumpkin here. Set of three jack-o'-lanterns. Yep, I don't even know how big this one is. We're gonna find out. our pillows and stuff already some there some there oh my gosh guys look how enormous these things are I can't even get them completely in the picture unless I put the camera way back by the wall <laughs> those are huge but that's totally awesome look we got the three in the middle those must be about four feet wide and uh, and then each of these is 12 feet tall look at that we got a giant arch that is so awesome. I am so ready for a Halloween movie now. Nice little nest over here. Blanket in case we want it. Look at this. I can't even get past the pumpkin to get out of the room. <laughs> Let's get our movie in and prepared. All right, yes, we are ready for the shows to begin. Let's go get our food. That smells so good. Look at that, guys. 
Look how delicious that is. All right, I've got to sink my teeth into this and give it a taste. We got some sausage, some uh, riced cauliflower, a little bit of uh, onion and red pepper in there. Mm-mm, mm-mm, mm-mm. Mm-hmm. 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 That is good. That was a good idea. And there's not too much spice in it either. The last time I used this stuff, it's called Slap Your Mama! The last time I used it, I made Cajun shrimp fried rice, stir fry, whatever you want to call it. And I mixed a little bit too much of this. It was too spicy. But this is just right. Mm-mm, mm-mm, mm-mm. Look at that. Holy crap. Mm. Mm-mm, 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 mm-mm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. We got our Halloween inflatable set up in there. We got the Great Pumpkin. We got uh, Michael Myers Halloween 1978. If you guys didn't watch last week's episode, it was Diary of a Wimpy Kid. And one of my absolute favorite Halloween scenes is in that movie. Go watch last week's episode and then you can watch that movie too. And if I want to keep going after that, I have Halloween H2O, Halloween Part 2. I don't even remember what all else. And let me just say, before you watch it, Halloween 1978 is not for kids. Although I will leave that up to you to decide. Alright, I'm going to cuddle up in my own Halloween cove, watch some movies, eat some of this deliciousness, and I will see you guys next Saturday.